All right. Welcome. Welcome back to some more Fallout Frey. Um, as you can probably tell, I took off um, ENB. I added a couple other graphical mods. Actually, I don't know. I was hoping to get higher FPS um, with this than I did with ENB. And it looks like I am just by a little bit, though, which is not exactly what I was looking for. Um, hmm. Sorry. Forgot to do that. I'm getting constant 30. Oh. It's weird. Whatever. Um, let's just get a move on here. Uh, speak to come. We can do that. Oh, I forgot. Yes, I need to go to Megaton and I want to um, find a thing. What am I thinking of? I need to find um, some chick. I forgot what her name was. But I'm gonna find her. Neither will you. I feel like my saturation's too high. Nope, none of you guys. Um, I don't remember what her name is. This is really unfortunate. I guess I'll just go talk to uh, Moriarty. Moriarty. Is this it right here? It's the back. I don't want to go in the back entrance. Um, yeah, I can probably go around here and get to it. Get to it easy enough. It's Jericho. <sighs> I talked to this guy already, didn't I? I no, I didn't. I, just when I had all but given up hope, my dear boy, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. Me too. I am Mr. And you, well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. Cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. Uh, Mr. Burke, is it? Please continue. I find myself enthralled. Finally, someone with a modicum of civility and common sense. I represent certain interests, and those interests view this town, this... Megaton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. You have no connections here, no interest in this cesspool's affairs or fate. You could assist us in erasing this little accident off the map. Go on, I'm listening. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little motivation a push I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge constructed for a singular purpose detonation of that bomb you'll rig it to the bomb then you'll get paid handsomely Ooh. what do you say throw in an extra 500 caps and you've got yourself a deal is that the best you damn can it do? I'm afraid I'm not impressed but Sims wants me to disarm the bomb. Sims is an idiot. He prides himself on his position as mayor and sheriff of this scrapyard. I told Sims... Okay, God, this better work. I told Sims I'd disarm it. Maybe some extra caps will change my mind. Is that the best you can do? I'm afraid I'm not impressed. You gotta be kidding me. Say I decided to help you. What's in it for me? You mean... Besides doing the world a favor by removing this pestilent scab of a town? Why, you'd be rewarded most handsomely. My employer is a very generous man. If it's bottle caps and luxury you're seeking, you shall have it. All right, Mr. Burke, I'll do it. Megaton will burn. Excellent. I had a feeling about you. Here's the fusion pulse charge. It needs to be installed inside the bomb. Okay. When it's done, 
Meet me at Tenpenny Tower. It's southwest of here, well out of harm's way. You can't miss it. Questions? Uh, messing with that bomb seems pretty technical. What if I can't do it? Lack the aptitude, you mean? You're not rewiring the thing, just attaching the pulse charge to the detonator. If you get stumped, talk to Leo Stahl. He might have something to help you concentrate. He's got a bit of a reputation. Leo Stahl. It's time for me to go. Don't let me keep you. I wish you'd give me more money. Oh, you piece of junk. Every day it's the same damn thing. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave station comes in fine. Galaxy News. The six has been shit lately. Work. Come on, work. I actually want to change Fazer 7. This. I want to change this to slow. Okay, there we go. Turning that off. Got something on your mind? No, I'm good, thanks. So, what I don't like is Never seen a ghoul the soft blur on everything. It's kind of annoying, but it's not that terrible, I guess. Hey, smooth skin, you need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Uh, let me think about it for a moment, my good man. Wait, you're not gonna hit me, yell at me, not even berate me a little bit? I haven't planned on it. Well now, that's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you... I'll risk it. Thanks, man. Gain car, damn it. Um What's else about Galaxy News Radio? Mr. Moriarty says we can keep it on. It's a good radio station. I like hearing the DJ three dog. Three dog he's helping the fight the good fight. The fight the good fight. If only I was a part of that instead of being stuck in this dive. I'm from my father. Middle aged guy, maybe you've seen him? Oh yeah. I do remember a guy like that. Honestly, I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty, he'll know more. Okay, come on. God, please, please, if you know anything about my father, you need to tell me. Sorry, smooth skin. I can't take the risk. Moriarty will What's the point of putting of things car? into my karma, or my, no, my karma, my charisma and speech? Yeah, what the hell do you want? If it's ever going to work. Alan Moriarty, at your service. Welcome to Moriarty. My saloon, my home, my slice of heaven in this backwoods little burg. You've got the caps, I've got your pleasure. Please sit down, make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. Looking for my father, blah, 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 okay. My God, it's you. The little baby boy all grown up. That's me. Persistent little bastard, ain't you? Then and now it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here, all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? Uh, my father and I were born in Vault 101. Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well. You stayed in my saloon, after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood of steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about your mom. Foolish. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now, you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. I, well, I love it. Um, I wasn't born in the vault. That's complete BS, and you know it. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there from some other fella, escaped, oh, five years back. 
All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault, we die in the vault, and all that other assorted lunacy. Kid, you've got better programming than our own Deputy Weld. You'd best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? Uh, I was kidding. Dad talked about you all the time. Not really. Where is he? Come on, come on. You seem like a nice kid, so I'm going to be straight with you. Your dad was here, and now he's not. And yes, I know where he went. But what you're asking me for is information. And information is a commodity. And like any commodity, it must be sold at a reasonable market price. So, what's reasonable? Let's say 400 caps, and daddy's location's yours. I'll have 100 caps. All right, kid. Let me help you out. You know, for all time's sake. If you don't have the caps to pay for the information, then maybe you could do a little favor for me. So let me do your dirty work. Who said anything about dirty work? You need some caps and I'm giving you a way to get them. It's just business. This junky bitch named Silver oh. borrowed quite a few caps from me. Claimed she could start funneling Jack and Psycho to me for a good price. Problem is, she scrammed with the loot and set herself up in Springvale so she can inject herself into a stupor. Get the caps she owes me, and they're yours. Yours to pay me with, anyway. <laughs> Can't tell me where my father is now. You got memory problems, kid? You ain't getting something for nothing. So pony up the 300 caps, and then we'll talk. 300? What the hell? You said it was 100, buddy. I did say it was 100 caps. And, as I recall, you said no. So now, I'm saying it's 300 caps. What'll you say this time? This guy's a... Jerks. Okay, let's just take a step back. 100 caps was reasonable. I'm reasonable, but I'm not crazy. How can you bargain with me and not have the caps? Yes. Hmm. Careful in DC now. Those super mutants can be a prickly bunch. <laughs> should shoot this guy. He's a... He's a butthead. Oh man, I'm glad to see you. Uh huh. Yeah, I don't care. Um. Anything for you, friend? I'm gonna sell you some stuff. That's a cool, dog. That's a cool, dog. Um. I don't know what I should sell him. Buy that. That that. Run away. I mean, I guess paint gun. I don't really need a paint gun. I'll take that. See you. Um. Can I repair this now? Nope. Nope. Look at ah, Jesus. That. Scared the crap out of me. Toda Megaton, Megaton, Megaton. What up, Jericho? I need ammo. Where's the armory? Uh. I'm blanking, I'm blanking, I'm blanking. Jericho, help me. I'm blanking. Um. Uh Where well hey there, stranger. I'm Manya. The old coot wandering around here is my husband. Ah Nathan. yes. I've seen him around. Anything we can help you with, ask me. Don't ask Nathan. He'll just blabber at you about the damned enclave all day. Um don't care. There's only one thing that concerns me in this town these days. What my damn fool husband is doing. He wanders around here all day and all night, preaching about the Enclave and trying to get parts for his guns. I'm not sure who's the bigger fool, him or me. After all, I married him. True. Uh, huh. It's not the lady I was looking for. Man, this guy, Jericho needs to chill out, really. Really. That's Cherko's house. What you got here, buddy? Huh? Anything in here? Mm -mm -mm. 
He he lives in a freaking dump. God. I mean, I don't need a the pistol. Let's play the nasty Jericho. Got a freaking spatula. As he keeps all his money and ammo on him. What a jerk. Where's the god dang armory? Hmm? It's the brass lantern. Were you just kidding about this? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh. Don't fool around with. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Don't worry. Um, armory, that's a church, Adam, it's a saloon, supply up there, okay, creators, no, that's, okay, we're, okay, let me talk to him for Pete's sake, this is ridiculous. Staying out of trouble, I hope. Shoot. Uh, weapon dealer. You'll probably want to see Moira at Crater. Oh, yeah, so she's, okay, never mind. Uh, Crater side supply, awesome. Vault hero to the rescue. What up? Oh, feel. Uh, you guys have ridiculous requests, right? I realize a lot of things, but this isn't one of them because it's a real scientific necessity and 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 not ridiculous at all. What I mean is, I need this research, and you're probably going to get erased. Okay. Um, I was over designed the bag. I can ask you where you work. I'm a research for the end of the year. Let me see what you have to sell. What do you need? I just need ammo. I need ammo, please. There we go. I'll take. Take all she got. All right. Um. Apparel aid. Misc. Okay, I'm good. Good hunting. Yeah, whatever. Try not to die. Awesome. Thank you. Oh, that chick is. I'd like to get her quest before I blow up this freaking town. I don't know where she is. All right. Following his footsteps, wasteland survival guide. I guess we can do that really quick since we're like right here. Actually, no, I'll do that off camera because that takes a little bit of time. So we'll do that later. Yeah, I don't know where that freaking chick is. Bloom or the soft focus or whatever it is is just a little too much for my taste. Maybe if I. Is it this which is the problem? No, that didn't do anything. No, that didn't change anything either. Hey, Vino. It's probably this. The Trek Vaseline Cam. TBH. Oh, God. That looks painful. Yeah, it looks like actually that that was it. That looks better to me, actually. 